What is going on everyone? It is Jaker GG and welcome back to another episode of Factions here in the Frontier Network. And today we have some very special things to talk about. First of all, we have this OP Blaze Grinder, and also we're going to be opening up more of these uh, the limited edition Easter keys. And before I say anything else, I want to get this out of the way before I forget. Um, you can use my coupon code, which is Jaker with a capital J. And you can get another 5% off on top of the sale. It's already 65% off. So you can get some really awesome deals right now because it's like 70% off. That's like a huge sale, more than Cosmic has ever done. So basically the top rank is like $40, I think. I don't really want to do the math right now, but like everything's super cheap right now. And the sale's ending soon, I think, because it was, it's been like almost a week now. So definitely go hop on that. If you do want to play the server, it's a perfect time to get a rank, even if you just want to get the first rank for like, I think it's like $4 with the sale so it's like why not you know anyways guys we're going to be showing you the new blaze grinder and uh, like i said opening five more of the easter keys and if you guys watched last episode i really didn't have the best of luck with these keys and um hopefully i'll do a lot better this episode maybe we'll get like a permanent potion that would be pretty awesome that's what i'm hoping to get um but yeah guys we got the we got the blaze one right here and as you guys can see 471 blazes which is insane like that is just beast mode and you guys are probably thinking oh they must have a lot of blazes we have four blazes, four blazes. So it's pretty even. It's pretty insane. Oh wait, no, never mind, never mind. I take that back. We have, we have, um, we have seven blazes. We had four earlier, but I guess someone added some. So we got seven blazes. They are all maxed level three. So they just spawn like crazy. They just, they just give you so many mobs. And if you guys are wondering what the whole levels thing is, basically for any spawner, you can do it with blazes. You can do it with cave spawners. You can do it with iron golem spawners. You upgrade them with levels, and it costs 10 levels to upgrade them to level 1, 20 levels to get to level 2, and 30 levels to get to level 3. So overall, like, to max out a spawner, what, will it take you, like, 5 minutes or something? Like, it's really awesome, because, uh, look at, there's Master. So we're, we're going to, you know, test out this thing. As you guys can see, it has a ton of blazes down here, and then also you can sell the blaze rods for bank. So you kill these blazes, and then also I'm using a looting four sword. So... Let me put hostile creatures up. Oh, that's really loud. Okay, uh, let's put that up. So, yeah, guys. So we got the blaze grinder right here. Tons of blazes. You can just grind for days and never run out of blazes, which is insane. So, um, if you guys don't do want to take this like uh, design of our blaze spawner, you can go ahead. It's like you can see how big it is. Um, I, I no, I'm glitching out, but it's it's based. Okay, never mind. Um, it's I think it's um, it's two chunks wide by two chunks wide. And there's it's split into four different chunks and um, it's really awesome it works really well and then it just has seven blazes so it works really good and then like I was saying blaze rods sell for a lot of money so you can um, you can get those blaze rods and you can sell them on the on the market or not on the market just on the shop and um, you get a ton of money so we're gonna we're gonna grind a little bit we're gonna see how many um, I think I'm gonna get to like I'm not gonna like stop recording I'm just gonna grind right through because I'm pretty sure I can get these levels pretty quick so let's buy some food Boom, boom, and we're gonna grind a little bit. We're gonna get like 40, how many, so we wanna get 33, 36, 39, let's get 42 levels. So let's get 42 levels, we can do some level 30 enchants, and then we will get into the keys, because I'm really hyped for those. And by the way guys, the Easter keys are only available till this Monday. So the day after Easter, you'll be probably watching this video if you watch it when it comes out. Today is Saturday, tomorrow is Easter, and then Monday is when the Easter keys end. And I also think that the limited edition Easter kit also ends on Monday, so if you guys do want to jump on that, it's uh, definitely the time to do it. Um, and yeah, that, yeah, that's basically it, guys. I hope you guys are having a good weekend. Um, for me, I'm on spring break next week. I don't know, some people had spring break this past week, like before Easter, and some people have it this upcoming week when I have it. So I don't really know um, like exactly when your spring break is, but mine is, uh, I got this whole week off, so I'm going to be doing it, making a ton of videos. Um, let me just tell them really quick I'm recording, so it'll stop bugging me. I'm recording. Okay. So, um, yeah, basically, I have this next week off spring break, so I'll be able to make a ton of videos. I'm going to be, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be making um, factions videos daily. At least I'm going to try to make it, they're going to be almost daily, if not every single day. Um, my cousin is coming over for three days. If you guys remember him, he's been in a couple videos. Um, he's coming over for a couple days, so I'm going to be doing a ton of stuff with him. I might pre-record some videos or something, because I'm not going to have a ton of time to record. Um, or we might make a video together or something, because uh, he's actually bringing his Xbox. So, um, we're going to be playing some black ops 3 and um csgo and stuff so i'm gonna be spending time with him so i won't have as much time to record but i still think i'm gonna get out some videos over spring break like i said 
um, hopefully daily, and it will it'll alternate Cosmic Frontier, Cosmic Frontier, because I know you guys love the Cosmic, and um, Frontier is also really fun for me, and I, I know a lot of you guys like it too, so we'll be making Cosmic and Frontier leaders. I don't know, I said leaders because I was reading this. Co cosmic and Frontier videos um, for the next week, so it's going to be a lot of fun. We might even make some other videos with like Fran and Jaguar, maybe we'll make some Skywars or something, so... Um, yeah, I think that's going to be enough grinding for now. I said I was going to get 43 levels, but I got a lot more. Um, can't really go wrong. Uh, so let's go ahead and grab all these. And I think I have some more blaze rods in this chest. Perfect. I, I'm glad that sound is off. That was getting annoying. Um, and then also a little tip. When you're selling all your stuff, if you go into the shop, um, on here you just do slash shop and you go to the shop. Um, blaze rods are in potion supplies, and if you want to sell your entire inventory, you click the you click the blaze rod with the um, with your scroll wheel. So like you click down your scroll wheel, and it sells your whole inventory. So there we go, twenty thousand. Sorry, twenty thousand dollars. Not too bad for like what five minutes, like if that. Maybe it might have even been less than five minutes. So we still have these skellies. Skellies are a great way to grind if you don't have blazes. If you guys don't have blazes, skellies are amazing. You get tons of money with the skelly drops. I'm just gonna grind them for a little bit to show you guys how much like the drops sell for. Um, and you can still one shot them if you. Oh, by the way, we have a strength two beacon, so that's why I'm like one shotting everything. Um, so definitely a good tip. You want to have a strength two beacon. And you want to have like high level sharpness swords with um with looting and axes are even better I think I just don't have a good axe to use right now so if we do slash shop go to the mob drops we'll sell all those sell all those look at sixteen hundred it's 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 pretty good you get you get decent money with those drops not as good as blaze rods but they're almost as good so anyways guys let's go ahead and enchant some stuff we're going to grab some books and some lapis and we're going to enchant some books um I'm thinking. I want to get some sharpness five axes, but the thing is, you can't get sharpness enchanting axes with vanilla, like an enchanting table. I don't think so. We're gonna do this. We're gonna put the books in. I'm, I'm thinking we're just gonna do all, all, um, all books. I think that's our best bet. So we got protection three. It's not terrible. Unbreaking three. That is awesome. Protection three. Like I said, not terrible. Sharpness three is not that good. Feather falling four is good. That's good. Fire protection is really bad. Fire protection. Ooh, luck of the sea two. Okay. Uh, power four, and we're out. Okay, but as you guys can tell, um, sorry, um, in in uh, in vanilla enchanting in 1.8, you can do a ton of level 30 enchants when only having like 50 levels. As you saw, I get eight level 30 enchants. So we're gonna throw off some of these. Um, I I don't need that. I don't need that. Um, and then I sharpness three. I I just don't want to mess with that. I well, no, I should have kept that sharpness three, but it's too late now. Threw it into the void. Um, that was actually kind of stupid. I should have should have kept that. But let's put these books away um, in this chest, and then we will put these in here. Okay. Um, someone's trading me actually. The cool thing about this server is you can trade anyone on the entire map. Like you don't have to be within ten blocks. You can. Oh, wow. Salt Salt Matt has the hookups, guys. This guy hooks me up big time with gear whenever I need it. And he gave me a Protection 5 helmet. That is awesome. MSG, MSG Salt Mad, TY. Um, so thank you to Salt Mad. He's been hooking it up with gear. Um, anyways, guys, I think we're going to go to spawn now. And we're going to open up these Easter keys. Um, and then when we're done with these, we're going to do all our kits. Because we can do, well, we can't do all of our kits. But we can do all of them. We can do Genesis 2, Genesis 3, and Genesis 4. So we're going to do those. And then um, maybe we'll get like a Supply Crate event. That would be pretty cool if we do have a Supply Crate event. Um... So yeah, let's go ahead and um, right click, oh, is it right click? No, that's a vote keys, okay. There it is. So the Easter keys, you guys can probably remember from last episode, this is all the stuff you can get. I'll just go through it really quick so you guys can see everything you can get out of the Easter key. Um, I'm, like I said, I'm hoping for that, that permanent speed. I'd also be like super hyped with the G kit. So here we go guys, first Easter key going in. Come on baby. Oh, there's Master, he's gonna give me some good luck. Come on. Oh, 256 DMD. That's rip. No. No. <laughs> Alright, come on. Give me something good. Just something decent. Oh, no. Is he really good? Really? Well, enjoy your TNT, dude. Seriously. Like, whatever, dude. Um, there we go. Oh, oh, why am I doing I forgot to throw out the pots. No. Oh, well, I got 50k, so it doesn't matter. Um, get, get out of here, kid. Get out of here. Okay, I'm doing really bad so far. I only have two two left, and gee, okay, I'm, I'm drinking. I'm drinking into this pot. I'm drinking into this pot. Um, oh lag. Okay. Um, 
Okay, now they can't even see me. GG. Okay. Well, they can see my key. Never mind. That's kind of dumb. Okay. Two more. Come on. Give me something good. Come on. Alright. 16 creeper eggs. That's... You know, it's not the greatest, but that's still pretty good. Come on. Last one. Give me, give me something good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. No, it's going to be obsidian. No. <laughs> rip. Rip, rip, rip. Alright, guys. We did get 13... I mean, 16 creeper eggs, which when we start... Look at that. 31 creeper eggs. When we start raiding... Oh boy, we are going to be ripping some bases. So, um, yeah guys, I have this silverfish spawner right here, which is actually really cool. Because it's the only one on the server, so that's pretty cool. Um, anyways, we're going to go back to the base. Like I said, we're going to do our kits. Wait, was that a key that I could do? That's a rare key. Okay, we're going to go home corner. Um, and then we are going to, uh, you know, go through, um, go through our kits, like I said. Okay, let's put this stuff away. We won't need it for now. And then, actually, I'll take the steak. Let's do our kit slash kit. Genesis. Genesis 2. Alright, we'll actually PvP with this. We'll grab that. Grab that. And then the bottle of enchantings I will put in here. We have a ton of bottle of enchantings, actually. Let me just splash some of these down, because I have too many. Alright. We're going to grab some more god apples. Actually, no, let's do our kits first, because one of them might come with god apples slash kit. Genesis three all right that's the block of gold and everything which you know it's always nice to get put all those away actually i am overflowing on diamonds so we can actually get rid of some of these diamond blocks i do not need all these so let's do this and let's go to our shop and sell all these uh boom all right thirteen thousand. that's actually pretty good okay let's grab some more god apples we'll grab four of them we'll bring some regular golden apples and then we'll do our last kit, which I think Genesis kit, Genesis 4. I think this is the potions. Yep. I don't even want these because they don't stack. Like, if these stacked, I'd be psyched because stackable speed and strength are awesome. But when they're not stacked, they're not worth having. So it <laughs> looks like Mask is going to take them. Uh, oh, surprise, the spy grade event. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, potions, potions, instant health, 64. We'll grab those. Strength, 10. Boom, boom. Speed, 10. We'll grab a ton of speed. And... Oh, we need arrows, we need arrows, um, mob drops, mob drops, arrow, this is infinity, yep, set to, one. Oh, set to one, bye, alright, boom, slash spawn, um, I think we're good, I think we're good, um, we have invisibility on, but obviously we're gonna be wearing gear, so it won't do anything, what I usually do in these, is I fly around, in, with invisible, with invisibility on, and I just grab the, the chests, but, since I'm wearing armor, I don't want to take off the armor, because if I get one-shotted, and I lose all this stuff, that'd be really, Really disappointing, but 20 seconds. Um, hopefully we can just swoop in and grab a couple chests. Usually you get like some protection four, protection three gear, and maybe even some gapples. So hopefully we'll get. I don't know if you can get like OP stuff out of these, like ranks or anything. But okay. Um, come on. Oh, come on, come on, come on. What the heck, really, dude? Really? Okay. I, I think there's. Yep, there's a chest right here. Come on, come on. All right, we got that one. Come on. Okay, that guy got something. Oh. Okay, this guy's wrecking us. Oh, no, 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 no. Roman soccer. Okay. Um, let's drink the speed. Let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Oh, I don't have a, um, I don't have a fire res. I need to get a fire res. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. I really need to learn how to bow boost, guys. Like, if you can, like, tell me how to bow boost, it would be greatly appreciated, because I don't know how to. Like, I legit don't know how to bow boost, and it's, like, a very needed thing on this server. Alright, he's just boosting me forward, so I'll take that. We're just gonna go right into the cop. Hopefully we have some people to help us here, or I can get away. Um, is there... Okay, under attacker. Okay, there's no one here to help me. Um, Alright, I'm capping the cop now. GG. I'm actually getting combos on him. Come on, I I'm actually down to fight this guy. If he if he wins, if, if he won v ones, I'll fight him. I just don't like getting three v one. And someone mentioned on one of my videos, they were like, "Jaker, why do you get mad at three v oneers when you three v one?" And it's like, eh, kind of has a point, but I get targeted so much, I just get really tired of it because all if I'm on like if I'm on solo, I'll just get three v one, and then people will purposely like target me even when there's other people. And it's just it's tough because it's hard to PvP when people are just going for you. And, um, yeah, guys, so we're actually doing, we're actually destroying this guy. We're doing really good against this guy. So hopefully he won't run to a trap. Um, because, I mean, I am 1v1ing him, so it's kind of like it's a legit 1v1. Oh, is he really going to go in the ravine? He really is. I don't know if I should go down there, because if he gets a teammate down there, and is his team, yeah, he's now under attackers here. 
Yeah, he's gonna go. He has his little teammate down there now. So I don't think I really want to do that. Are they fighting? Did he just kill him? Oh, I think he just killed him. I kind of want to just go. I'm gonna fight him, guys. It's 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 too late. If if we die, we're done. So, but we're fighting this guy. Come on. Oh oh, what was that? What was that? I don't know. Someone just popped. Um. Come on, come on. Oh, he's eating a god apple. We're eating a god apple. We should probably drink a drink a strength. Let's drink a strength. And a speed. All right, our gear might be breaking because this guy's using an axe. Oh yeah, our gear's probably gonna break before him. Come on, Roman, get out of here! No, 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 no! You can't have your gear. All right, under attacker. Come on. All right, if he honestly, I'm I'm down for him to just run away. Like I'm down just to like get out of here. Um, like like truce up. Like I'll take your gear. Just like truce, truce up. Um. Come on, corrupt shadow. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. No. Get out of here. All right. Um. Oh, we got all his gear. We got all his gear. Oh, he had a really good axe. He had a really good axe. Come on, get out of here, dude. Get out of here. I want to get out of here. Come on, Corrupt Shadow, kill him. Come on, dude, why are you running? I need to get out of here. Alright, um, die. Alright, let's go, let's go. I need to get out of combat. It takes 30 seconds to get out of combat. MSG, Corrupt, keep, keep Roman off me. Oh, I can't, FCF. Uh. Alright, hopefully he'll take the hint. Uh, come on, guys. Slash CT. Three seconds. Slash fly. Slash fly. Oh, we got out. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. All right, under attackers down there. I am so hyped, guys. I am so hyped. We didn't actually get that kill. I think he actually died from fall damage, but... Oh, what the heck? Who's that? Close the door. Close the door. Close the door. Who is this? Oh, it's Master. Okay. Oh, no. We're getting door... Hey, let's, let's fight this guy. Let's fight him. Let's, let's just fight him. Oh, he's gonna go in his trap. Okay, that's fine. Um, let's go back. Um, I'm gonna try to get out of here. Uh, that guy just literally messaged me in Skype, so that's kind of rip. Please don't DDoS him. <laughs> okay, um, let's go in here and slash CT. Okay, slash. Actually, we can just fly away. Slash fly. All right, we're gonna go take a look at this gear that we got. We actually got some really good gear. I think like a sharpness five, unbreaking four axe. That is awesome. That is going to be my new best weapon. So, let's go ahead and go right here. Okay, we're honestly... Um, let's see. We can... This gear is starting to get broken. Let's throw out all these pots. Um, and get some room in here. Alright. Uh, regular diamond sword we don't need. Alright, so we got some really good stuff. Power 5. That's the same bow that I'm using. So let's go home. Home corner. And we're going to put away the, some of this gear. Um, okay. Go to the chest. I think I'm going to um, I'm gonna go out in PvP a little bit more, and then we're gonna end off the episode. This is definitely going the PV. Um, let me get some more protection for gear because we need to um, we need to put on some new gear because this gear is breaking. Protection four and protection three. I kind of want protection four. Do I have any in here? PV two. Um, protection three. Protection four. Okay, let's put away this gear, and this this axe will go on our PV. And um, I'm hopefully going to max out my axes, guys. I have this Sharpness 5, like, without unbreaking, but it's hard to PvP with because it breaks fast, and I also can't grind with it. And the, something cool about this server is, guys, you can um, level up your MCMMO by killing mobs. So, like, if I kill mobs, my sword levels go up, or axe levels, or an arm. Uh, actually, I don't think it works with an arm, but it works with, like, archery, swords, and axes. So it's actually really helpful. And um, also, max, uh, max axes and max swords are 500, so... It's uh, not too OP, but it still at least gives you something to grind for. So I think I'm going to go out here one more time. We're going to see what we can do. Let me just grab one more God Apple just in case we get in a long fight. Um, and then I think we're going to PvP a little bit more. Um, actually, let's try to knock the guy off the Koth just for fun. Um, we're gonna, Like I said, we're going to PvP a little bit more, and then we're going to end off the episode. Who's here? All right, I think it's this guy copying it. Oh, we already we already got, a, we got him with a punch five. Or not punch five, like punch one, but still, we got him. Alright, this guy has a really good axe. Um, let's knock him, knock him. Yeah, we knocked him. Okay. I, yeah, these guys, I think these guys are all on the team. Oh, this guy's, this guy's running away. Oh, he's about to god apple up. Come on. If this guy's solo, I'll fight him. Yeah, I think he's solo. That's actually good. We could fight him. Come on. This guy was the guy that was down in that ravine, I think. We're actually wrecking him because he's just running. It's not a good thing to run because if you have speed... Oh, is he going in this trap? I think he is. We got lag. 
We got lag. Oh no, he's turning around. He's turning around. Change of plans. Come on. I like this guy's cape. It's a nice cape, but I'm sorry I have to kill you. Alright, this he's running right in front of our trap. I don't know where this guy's going. He's just going in circles. I don't know if he's like trying to find something and he can't find it or or what, but he is he is on a mission. Did he just god apple up? Oh he was eating steak. Oh boy. We're actually we're actually do getting some really good hits on this guy. Um, I just don't want to fall in a trap. I feel like he's going right right to a trap. All right, there's a trap right here. But is he going in that one? He might be. Oh boy. Um, let's not get trapped. Let's go on the speed. I I'm I'm losing hunger. I'm gonna have to eat some steak soon. This guy is on the run. It's kind of annoying how these factions show up because I I like can't keep track. Oh, there he is. There he is. Um, that's definitely a trap. Uh, yeah, that is definitely a trap. I am not falling for that. Like, that's, that's honestly a pretty, it's pretty cool how we put it in the trees, but, yeah, that's a little bit obvious. Sorry, dude. Just a little bit. Alright, well, we'll let that guy be. Um, but, yeah, I think that's gonna be it for this episode. We, we did a little bit of PvP. We got a, we got, well, we didn't really get a kill. Technically, we did hit him into the ravine, but, I mean, it wasn't, it was kind of a cheap kill. I'll be, I'll admit it. If I died like that, I'd be pretty mad, but, nevertheless, it's a set as a set. We got a set, we got a good axe, and, um, I'm really happy about that, so... Yeah, guys, if you did enjoy this video, be sure to drop a like on it. Um, all the info on the server's in the description if you want to check out the forums, the store, or the IP, which is FrontierNetwork.co. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.